I'm um, guys. It's Mark here from YouTube. I'm sorry I haven't done a video in a while, but I've been working on a big home project, which I will tell you about soon. But the main reason I'm doing this video today is because Mac OS X 10.8 was released two days ago. It is called Mountain and and I downloaded a copy of it last night. So I thought I would run through how to make a beautiful DVD of Mac uh, OS X Mountain Lion. So then you can do a fresh install because I don't like to upgrade. I like to do a fresh tail reinstall of the OS. So, okay, we're gonna need a couple of things. We're gonna need a dual layer DVD and we're gonna and you're going to have to have a copy of or a of OS X Mountain Lion. First thing you need to do is go into your application folder and find the Mac OS X Mountain Lion app then you need to right click on the app and then you go show package contents then you need to click on contents then you need to uh, open, up, open up shared support now, now this, this file is what we want to copy to the DVD. But, 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 but first, you need to copy that to the, the desktop. So, And then you need to hold down the ALT key or hold down the ALT key and drag it to your desktop. Then you need to copy it. And let's wait and now copying as you can see here. I'll do this all in real, real time for you. It's a 4.35 gig file, so it won't fit on a normal 4.7 gigabyte DVD. You're gonna have to use a dual layer. So once that's copied, done. Now we can minimize this. Now you need to open up disk utility by going into spotlight and typing in that. You need to name now you need 
to put in your blank DVD. to find it. Okay. Then yes you can all that. Click on the word burn. Then this will pop up. And now you need to find the file which is here. And then you need to click on burn. And then you need to click on burn again. And now you're going to prepare it to be burnt. So I might pause the video yeah, and come back when it's all, almost done. Hey, yeah, yeah, guys, I'm back. I'm, the burning process is all, almost done. And then I will tell you how to do the next step. So... Now we're going to wait for a little minute. And it is... Done. And that and that took about um, 10, maybe 15, 20 minutes to burn. Not long. Now I guess I'm closing the session. I guess they're verifying it. Make sure you back up all your data with you on your main C drive or whatever drive you have your operating system on. Make sure there's no other data on there because it's going to wipe it off. So, yes. And to, to, and to install it, you need to restart your Mac with the, with the DVD in the machine. And you need to hold down the option key. And that will give you the option to choose to boot from the hard drive or to boot from the DVD, DVD, DVD choose the DVD, DVD option and then you can format the drive from there so, 
and then and then you can do so the new operating system that way but I'm not going to do it for a while because uh, for a little, little while yet but yeah because I've got some um, projects that I'm working on I'm working on a project at the moment um, I'm going to network my whole house and I will do all the heaps of videos on that for you just to show you how to do it and show you how I'm doing it and I'll show you how to make your own internet plug or your own internet cable and I'll show you how to mount, mount um, wall plates uh, on the wall so look forward to that that's gonna be a big project so I already started drawing up plans last week um yes so there, there'll be plenty more videos coming on that soon um, I think that's about all. So, thanks for watching. And I'll put all the links down below. For the Apple Store for the Apple Store and for my um, Twitter feed that's the best place to follow me on because I, I don't use Google Plus Mac so yeah, um, this, this is still very fine um, I, I, I hope that helped. Uh, uh, thank you for watching and we'll see you in my next video. Alright, see you guys soon.